Your nephew's got his wedding present. Nicely done. He's a good kid. He deserves something. Hopefully you'll look after him. Nico, you looking for more work? I'm always looking to earn a bit of extra cash. Great. I know a guy who needs a man like you. Only operates on an outside line. Go to the pay phone on the corner of Petulo and Hardtack. He'll call you. What is wrong with you? That one. Half right for you. Thanks. What do you want, Dimitri? I already thought that there was something not quite right about you, Nico. Now that I hear you are friends with bright stockings and burning crane, I know what it is. Stop blackmailing my friends, Dimitri. You do not want to anger me more. Persuade them to give up the contract. We can work together. I will cut you in, Nico. Let's be friends. I made the mistake of working with you before. It's not one I'll repeat. Goodbye. Hello, I'm a friend of Phil's. Nico Bellic. I know who you are, brother. You're after some money. Just like everyone else in this city. What's your deal? People come to me when they need something handled. I come to people like you when I need someone handled. Do you get me, brother? I get you. When you've taken care of something for me, call me on my cellular, but no specifics. Phil's good at that. I only talk business on a hard line. Go to Alderney City. The target you require is on top of the booth tunnel.
What's wrong? Nothing, sweetie. Oh, my God. You're the lucky one. What? You could slice cheese on those puppies. I must be the only slob without cheekbones. I'm thinking of getting implants. But you sounded hysterical. Oh, sometimes I can't bear to be alone. I'm so glad you've come back into my life, even if you did try to kill me. I'm so excited. What are we doing here? We're going to have fun. Fun. Yes. It's a four-letter word, I know, but we can still try. Look, more people want me dead than alive. I'm working for the Mafia. The police and the government agency are both on my case. I kill and steal to scrape together a living so that my cousin can fritter it away online and pay off debts. And all the while, people are trying to kill us. What is fun? Honey, you are stressed. Oh. Goodbye, Florian. No, 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 you don't, Nico. I need you. I need you to come on this boat trip with me. I need to talk to someone who truly knows me. When I knew you, you were training to be a shepherd. And you wanted to be a professional wrestler. <laughs> Actually, maybe it does all make sense. You understand me. Both of me. Come on. Bryce accidentally left the keys on purpose somewhere I could steal them. You drive. I'll work on my tan. My midriff is really pale. All right. Let's have fun. Ah! Ah. Head out to sea, sailor. My life is in turmoil. Bryce is pulling his hair out over this blackmail thing. His wife is getting on his back about yours truly. I think she suspects. It's a nightmare. I don't know how else I can help you. Look how long it took me to find you. I know, sweetie. Let's forget about him and have some F U F. Ah! 
Perfect, sweetie. Let's stop. Ahoy, sailor! Cute guys off the starport brow. Mm. Scratch that. Not so cute. Rojni Rusi! Let me see. They don't look like they're on the pleasure cruise. After them. Bryce's wife is going to freak out about his boat. This was meant to be our fun day, Nico. Why does everything that's meant to be fun have to be so miserable? I don't know. We just got to get these guys or they'll just come back. I told you that there was no time for this. People are after me, and I have to stay alert. You, Bert, are in this too. You have to keep your eyes open. They're wide open, sweetie. I'm focused. 100%. Let's get them. Our noble hero returns from battle. Then not a problem anymore. Nico, you are my knight in shining armor. Thank you. I'm sorry our fun day wasn't so very much fun. See you soon. See you.
Yeah. I'm here to see Mr. Pecorino. Well, I didn't think you were here to sell me insurance. So, you here to work for him, shoot him, or arrest him? Or maybe all three? It's okay, Mrs. P. I'll deal with this. Yeah. I'm in a life-threatening situation, and I'm having a conversation here. He could have killed me. You're useless. Organized crime, my ass. With guys like you, no wonder this organization is doing so wonderfully. You, Nick? Come on. Peg! What? Someone for you. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. So, were you followed? I don't think so. Oh. I mean, who knows? Exactly. I mean, we can pretty much guarantee you were followed. The question is, did you know about it? And right now, I don't know the answer to that question. But to be honest, I don't really care, neither. I know enough about you, your cousin, your friends, I know a lot of people around you end up in jail. So maybe. But that's the same all over town. This is a dying game. I don't understand. I mean, I'm gonna ask you to deal with a problem. And you're gonna deal with it. Or you're not gonna deal with it, and you're gonna be a problem that somebody else has to deal with. But me, I ain't doing nothing. Yes, okay. So what's the problem? We'll get to that. Anthony! Yo! Did Phil call? Not yet, boss. Ray called. <sighs> of course he did. I wonder, is it better to have a talented snake or a historical lion who's gonna be cut down in his prime? I don't know. What do you think? I don't understand what you're talking about. <laughs> you do. But I ain't gonna push. Anthony, get in here! Boss? Where's Big Pete and Marco? On their way. <sighs> Listen to me. Here's what the plan is. Me and two of my guys are gonna meet with a couple of boys from the Pavano family. I need these guys if we're ever gonna be taken serious. You know, get on the commission. Now the thing is, these guys ain't, shall we say, shown us the appropriate respect in the past. I want you to run security. Keep an eye on things, because they won't be looking out for you. Ah, here they are. It's either them or the cops. It's them. They're outside. Looks like Ray's here, too. I know it's them. God, give me strength. I'll be out in a minute. Look after Ray till I get back. Hey, Tone. Hey, Ray. I need to speak with Pegorino. Hey, what, what are you doing? He's, he's busy. Hey, Nico. Huh. Oh, boss, salve. Get up. I'm sorry, boss. This guy's everywhere like a freaking cockroach or something, huh? <laughs> In a good way. Ray, you and me is going to talk. The boss has got business. Yeah. Uh, boss, I got you this because I care. You boys have fun. Waiting for Hitty. Let's go. According to research carried out by Pride Brew, men who drink light beer are ten times more likely to pussy out of the fight. The study. You guys all friends now? Nice. You best hope you made a good first impression on Nico, boys. He's gonna be the one looking out for you, darn as me. Well, he's being paid to look out for me, so saving you guys' asses would be overtime. <laughs> That's just if the shit goes down, right, boss? Battles with the fuck with you. Wake up, you fucking mook. 
Everybody's trying to fuck everybody. We're just hoping they got the manners to smile to our faces before they do it. You giving them a nice little offering, little skip? They ain't gonna turn up their nose at that. God, give me strength. It's like I'm dealing with children here. No wonder I ain't on the commission when my muscle is this stupid. If the Pavanos is a Liberty City family, what are they doing coming out to Alderney for this meet? I let them operate out here from time to time. The man has worked a little shy business on this side of the West River. They also control a few bookies. I don't mind them taking a bite. I don't even make them give me a taste. Hopefully, they're gonna respect that when it comes time to ask them for a favor. You can't be too confident if you've got me here. Your insurance. I'm the captain of this ship because I look at every possibility. Check to make sure my ass is covered in each situation. I think about what's gonna happen if this guy screws me, if this one turns states, and so on. That's why you're the boss, boss. Shut up! Jesus, you're worse than my mother. Anyways, that's why Ray ain't ever gonna make it to the level he wants to reach. He's too busy thinking about himself. That diamond fuck up his case in point. I'm like a fucking chess player. You're covering me for six moves ahead when me and the Pavanos is just putting our first pawns out there on a checkerboard. Ah, oh, I like what you did there, Skip. Give him the rifle, Marco. You expect him to start throwing empty cans from there if this thing kicks off? No way, Skip. Here you go. Nico. Go up into that building. There should be a spot where you can see over to me. Don't start shooting unless they attack us. I don't want this stink screwing up for no good reason. If the rest of the commission knew they did this, I'm sure the whole city will be up in arms. The motherfuckers try to whack me at a sit down.
They're trying to make off with my tribute! The fucking nerve! We're gonna ice those fucks, Nico! Alright, let's get these slime ball bastards! People like that give Italians a bad day! Whatever happened to the honor society and all that shit? Can't say I know! They didn't even send a fucking popo! This is a declaration of war! The Pagarinos and the Pavanos are hitting the masses! You heard it here first! I saw it through the scope of that rifle! We're gonna get that gift back and make this crew pay for their disrespect! Come on! about Marco and Pete. Marco and Pete? Oh, yeah. Those guys didn't make it, did they? Well, too fucking bad. They knew what they were signed on for. Weren't complaining on the way out, were they? No, they weren't. Happy to be on board with the skipper. Yeah, well, they seemed like good kids. Ah, these kids come and go. It ain't worth paying attention to them until they prove they can survive. I just move on and hire some wannabe wise guys off the street. It's that simple? Has to be. I only start paying attention to my crew when they start putting me in an awkward position, either because they know too much in my rat, or because they got too much power and they're too smart to get themselves clipped. Ray was nothing to me until he started earning big and sticking his nose in places that didn't belong. Rats seem to get everywhere you don't want them to be. The only way you know is by finding their shit all over the place in the morning. Phil's different. He's been my man for a while. I mean, how much can I do with a guy who ain't a full Italian? He's 90% Irish. It don't do too well for the reputation of us Pecorinos, having St. Patrick that high up in our organization. You see the respect we're getting out on the street? Jesus! Good, kid. Kept your head when everyone else was losing theirs. Sometimes literally. We're gonna need your skills again soon. Arrivederci. <laughs> 